are signs for gold horrors and capricorn welcome to my channel this is chelsea thank you so much for liking and subscribing i really appreciate your love and support in this reading we are going to find out what's your upcoming good news and please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you and thank you for being patient with me our signs i'm still coughing and i still have a sore throat so i sound quite bad <laughs> I'm pretty sure of that, but let's get your reading started, okay? Spirits and angels, please show me for Earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, and Capricorn. What are their upcoming good news? It's going to happen really fast. Knight of Swords. Eight of Cups here, yeah, Emma first. Something positive. Something you thought you may have lost. That it may have ended but good news is it's not lost okay um the tower am up first avoiding any tower moment definitely good news <laughs> yeah higher fun at the bottom of the deck we got the 801s 801s uh means good news good news is coming in and the eight of wands is quite a fast energy plus we've got the nine of swords here so super fast this good news is coming in ten of swords this indicates an ending though so but with the five of cups here in reverse it feels like something that you may have been feeling disappointed about uh you may have been feeling sad you thought this is done uh this is over but it is not over okay um, or it could also indicate for some of you certain doors are closed but then new doors are opening up for you which which I feel like they are even better than what you wanted previously okay and for some of you eight of cups here in reverse can indicate some good news in regards of someone returning to you someone who may find it really hard to move on from you that's just for some of you if this is what you're looking for because it can indicate somebody returning with eight of cups here in my verse just give me one second or signs <coughs> sorry about that oh it's so annoying right let's cough the hangman here is in my verse and we've also got the chariot some good news in regards of travels traveling plans or you know, the chariot is also a, some sort of a movement, 801s right next to the chariot. For some of you, it's moving home, moving house, um, or again, could be you traveling for work or traveling for leisure as well. The chariot is a very successful card, right? And it keeps moving forward victoriously, so you're winning something. Some of you, you may be winning something some uh, communication coming in someone may tell you that or um, it could be, I'm hearing certificates <laughs> for some of you certificates um, either you graduating good news that you you're gonna be graduating or having really good grades if you're still studying if it's not you know if you're older and you're done with studying 801s the cherry here can indicate some sort of a forward movement that is going to be very successful and it also feels like it's there's this energy of someone telling you or something telling you that hey um you can go now that's what i'm getting here you can go now and it's going to be okay you're going to be very happy about it um you're going to feel good and confident about it okay i know that sounds a little bit vague but that's what i'm getting right now and it may have something to do with your career or money queen of pentacles queen of pentacles is the queen of money so again it could be related to your career or money the chariot also is a form of transportation some of you good news in regards of buying a car uh, a vehicle or it could be again it could be traveling but Mm, or buying a house too yeah right next to the queen of pentacles she's sitting in her garden it's definitely a home so it depends for each and every one of it for each and every one of you it's it's obviously not going to be exactly the same thing but some of you it's um good news surrounding your car your home either you buying one or someone giving it to you or you winning one okay 
the tower here is in my first. Give me a second. <coughs> Yep, the tower in reverse for me indicates you avoiding some sort of a disaster. Some of you, it's you, good news will be you avoiding a disaster, right? And then um, this disaster, I feel, will save you from losing money or losing your home or losing some sort of a property, property okay? And five of cups here is in reverse. Again, it feels like there could be some opportunities, new opportunities in regards to your career or money, okay? The higher fund also can indicate marriage. The higher fund uh, is an organization or some sort of structure, religious really belief. Um, again, marriage, teachers, students, dynamics, um, but the higher fund also can indicate for me right now, this moment, some sort of a good karma. Um, good news coming in because of some good karma, good deeds that you have done. Uh, maybe you have helped some people before or you have given some advice um, to somebody. I don't know. It, it just feels like someone is going to return to you and tell you whatever you've said to them, whatever you've helped them, supported them or taught them. Um, they are mm, they're doing well, they're successful because of that. So they may bring you a gift. That's another thing I'm getting here. Some of it, that could be someone bringing you a gift or gifts, but I feel like they are quite lavish gifts. They're not just more little thing. Um, it feels like a big gift, okay? Let's see more. King of Wands in love first. Page of Swords. The lovers, yep. See, for one, some of you, it's marriage, proposals, uh, engagement, moving into a new house. Num four ones can indicate a home situation or an actual home. Just give me one second. <coughs> wow, the lovers here also can indicate um, a choice. Uh, some good news in regards of someone choosing you, okay, or an organization or company. Um, something is choosing you or someone is choosing you, okay. And I feel like for some of you, this may be love. For a lot of you, this may be actually be love. And King of Wands here is in reverse. This may be uh, someone whom could be a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, telling you that they have changed or that they are changing. Uh, and they would like to commit to you. And with Page of Swords, they've been um, spying on you. This person may have been keeping tabs on you. And you have turned your back on them, right? With the Queen of Pentacles here. So this person might just return to you pretty soon. Feels like maybe within four days, four, four weeks or four months. Four months. This person is going to choose to tell you that they love you and they want to reconcile with you wanting to take the relationship to the next level and that they have other options, seven of cups here in my verse, but they're choosing you. You are the best, okay? I will afford you in here. This can indicate travels as well. Again, a lot of traveling I'm getting here as signs for some of you. Good news in regards of you either winning like a ticket to go somewhere or somebody giving you an opportunity to travel for free or travel for work. Um, Will of Fortune also indicates good luck. So for a lot of you, some good luck coming in. Um, for some of you, you may take a gamble on something, right? I feel like it's going to pay off with the Will of Fortune here. So this gamble, again, it can be any sorts of gambling, but uh, I'm not advocating gambling because... I have family members who have gambling issues and, well, you know, it's definitely not a good thing. <laughs> definitely not a good thing because everybody else got affected by it when they lost the money and they, they borrow money from loan sharks and all that kind of stuff. So I'm not trying to tell, you know, <laughs> I'm not trying to say, hey, you're going to be very lucky even if you were to gamble and then encourage you guys to go gambling so i don't want to be hell responsible if you lose money or anything like that but you know well fortune just indicates you know finally fortune is on your side luck is on your side things are changing 
right? Wheel of Fortune also can indicate again travels because this is a compass, right? Um, if it's not about traveling, it's about how now finally everything is gonna be in place for you. Everything is going to work like it's meant to be. That's what I'm getting here. You're gonna be able to see that everything that has happened in the past, some endings, betrayal, hurt, pain, ten of swords here, um, or you experiencing a tower moment, you're gonna realize and and that you're gonna see with the will of fortune here in an upright position that wow, this is the reason why this was the reason why all of these things happen had happened so that you will come to this place which is a way more fortunate place a way better place and for some of you this may have something to do with you traveling moving homes or your career or it could be a love situation where there was someone who may not be able to either commit or somebody whom the king of wands here in reverse who may still It feels a bit like King of Wands and Mother, someone whom either was very impatient. Um, again, feels like they couldn't commit or they were very impatient or that they could be abusive in some way, shape or form. That's just for some of you. feels like this person is changing and acknowledging uh, with the Hierophant here, the mistakes that they have done in the past and they're choosing to make these changes. Well, Fortune also can indicate a second chance. For some of you, it's you. Some good news in regards of second chances, second chances in love or second chances in your career here. Or for ones here, buying a second home, yeah? Or having two residency, like, or two citizenship for some of you. Okay, Earth Signs, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn, this is your reading. Hope you resonated. Um, if you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm open for personal readings. If you'd like to book me, my information is in the description box below. Um, I'm going to leave you with the playlists, two playlists on the screen right now. Check them out if you want to. One is from my second channel. It's a travel vlog channel. Second playlist. Sorry, I'm going to cough. <coughs> second playlist is from this channel. It has all of the readings that I've done for you and for the rest of the signs for different topics, different questions. Check them out if you want to, and I hope to see you back here again soon. Take care, Earth Signs. Bye.